Um, Mammoth, Blackguard are two very solid maps. Um, and it's kind of unique in that it has, you know, the floating platform off on the left. Shouts out to Core. Yep. And here we go, game one. Uh, Page Stardath, Stardath taking a a page out of Page's book and going for those dare loops. And now Page said, "Okay, here we go. We're gonna go into Qatar, Qatar, and I'll show you who can do it better, or at least is trying to." <laughs> I mean, if Stardath gives him the opportunity, Page is gonna go crazy with it. Tries to get the the dodge to reverse down sick too. A good option, but Stardath does find the punish on that. A very tight timing for him to do that as well. Oh, Ooh, nice side nice. air from Page to get the reversal off stage. Stardeath turning around, looking to find some form of edge guard. The weapon throw is not going to connect. Neither did the down sig, but it is going to be a Qatar mirror match again between these two. Sig's a little different, but, you know, Caspian, such a crazy pick in this regard, uh, can be very dangerous to move up against. Very difficult to advance on any Caspian because all of those SIGs can come out and just stop your advancement. You're going to see a lot of side SIGs, a lot of neutral SIGs coming out from Stardath here. Oh, that doesn't quite kill. Page just trying to weapon deny, gets hit with that side light. Not quite enough, but another one would kill. Nice neutral air to defend himself from a ground pound, though. Dead even, both of them in, like, almost black-red health here. And that recovery will be stock one going to Page. This is going to be a close set. Page? I mean, it's already close. Two minutes in, and it's completely even at two stocks fresh. Yep. It's a brand new game already. Page just using those, realizing that he does have a bit of a, he has a bit of an advantage Katars into gauntlets, so he's he's abusing it. He's going in and using his his better his better um, just the weapons come out quicker for Page, or the attacks come out quicker mm -hmm. for Page, so he's using them right now to his advantage. But then start off swap back to the Katar Katar, uh, slight lead in the favor of Page right now. Page finding the sword. Downlight doesn't go into a combo. You don't see that very often. Goes for a, a mix-up op option instead. Goes for the reverse neutral light. That was interesting. Paje, though, uh, trying to control the spacing with the sword. Uh, Star of Death, no weapon right now. Gets knocked across the map. Paje with the guitars. Goes for the side air. Not going to connect. A neutral air. Throwing out moves. Just trying to create hitboxing space. Paje holding that edge guard. The platform they are giving Stardust a little bit of room to work with, but Page takes it right over, snatches that weapon away. Stardust with a haymaker, turning things right around. Page back with the sword. It's it's just back and forth between these two. Yeah, um, Stardust has done a pretty good job of trying to get this lead to shrink a little bit, but I believe Stardust would probably well that'll kill. That's that's what'll kill. I thought he was even a narrow way, a neutral arrow way. Um, from dying there. And now Page, not quite in the kill percent now he is, um, can go in and try and extend this lead. And he's got Katars into an unarmed matchup, so there's no reason why he shouldn't be able to extend this lead. Oh, a nice recovery from Stardust though. Page going in on Stardust right now. It's just his stock to extend. Stardeath, not really on the back foot. He's got a pretty fresh stock, and he's going to be finding that kill with the with the re Qatar recovery, swapping out, getting rid of that weapon spawn. Page finding his own. It's going to be Qatar's. Little neutral there. Just trying to keep the pressure. Oh, the D sig. Ties the game up with that D6 because both hit huge damage. Oof. And that's game one going to Star Death, I think. Oh, maybe not. Not just yes, yet. It is. Oh, there uh -oh. it goes. 
game it was going to Stardath. What a play! What a comeback from Stardath to pull that one back. Huge comeback. Yeah. Huge comeback. Page took the advantage early on. Stardath showed that he has a mastery over his movement, the dash plays, and everything else, bringing it all to a head to make that comeback work. Star Death, game number one, a super exciting fashion. Yeah, and we are going to game two, and it looks like we are going to, oh, we are going to Shipwreck. Both Katars, a set of gauntlets, even Sword, all these weapons can edge guard really, really well. Uh, let's see if they use these short edges to their advantage. Start things off with Star Death with a huge unarmed combo to put Page in the deep yellow already. Hmm. Page trying to win the Qatar versus Qatar matchup here to uh, to tie it back up. Stardath just stand two two and a half jump heights up, and Page just can't get up there to to bring him down. Essentially, Stardath throws up the neutral sig. Not going to connect Page with the retaliation. Stardath though, ooh, side sig is going to get punished for Page. Hit for hit between these guys. You can see how careful they are. Oh, the D6. Down that's sick. stock one. Yep. Getting caught at that range off stage on shipwreck. That's certain death. Yeah, no chance. Every single time. All right. We are moving on to the second stock. Page in the yellow. Star death in the red, but probably not recovery range kill yet. So, Page's got a little bit of work to do here. Weapon toss from the gauntlets, looking for the Nair, but hits him with the that Sair anyways, into the side sig. And Page, is, this game is starting to slowly slip away from Page. Every hit is basically a bonus damage for Stardath right now. Stardath is doing a good job. I mean, he took the first game, all the pressure is on him. This is his game to win. Page. Oh, getting caught by the side sig. Not quite dead yet, but he's got Katars. Can't get back. He oh. just barely tapped. That'll side kill, though. Side air is all she wrote, though. Just a quick jump up side air, and this is tournament stock for Page. Oh, big neutral sig. That was really well done. That was just good, good spacing and knowing that Page is going to be desperate trying to find these, these kills. Oh man, Stardust coming back. He's got the potential for a three stock right now. And Page, the down sig, not ah. capturing. And that is Caster's Curse coming in right in. Page finding the kill. And now it is a decent position for him to be in. You Caster's Cursed, another one there, Froned. It's going to happen every <laughs> time. I mean, it's going to happen every time. But like, there's no getting around it. Okay. You got to call it out because of the potential. You got to build that story. You're right. <laughs> Page trying, trying to make to, an approach. Oh, go ahead. Oh, it's, it's trying to make an approach on Stardath, but Stardath is playing this just essentially knowing that he doesn't have to make, and that's game. Wow. That is set. That's that is a set. And Page finishing fourth once again. 